this is Cougar with your Trendwire fashion update for September 10th. Now, of course, if you're anywhere in the United States of America, I don't know there's, if there's a single place where it's not extremely hot. And um, likewise, it was blazing hot here in Los Angeles. But uh, if you wanted to catch a little bit, or if you were like me and had to catch a little bit of a break from the sun, I definitely caught some awesome fashion shows from New York Fashion Week. Yes, of course, it's still going on. Um, I was looking at Monique Lelier's show. We definitely got into the Hill Figure show and some other kind of off the beat classics, now, now becoming classics, like Jason Wu and Y3. And then a real up and comer of, as of late, Mason Margiela. You know, I don't know if you remember, we talked about them a few weeks ago. Margiela is going to be doing an upcoming collaboration with H&M. So that was an exciting runway show to watch. Um, but one of the runway shows that really caused the most kind of comments on Twitter and everything was Zach Posen. Now, Zach Posen, the, the, everybody knew that there was going to be some sort of surprise at the show. They thought the big surprise was going to be Coco Rocha walking in a show, but it turned out that he got classic model Naomi Campbell to come and walk for his show. And uh, it was incredible to see her back in action on the runway and just, you know, caused total uproar at his show. So great, great for her, great for the label. And um, actually, personally, my favorite show, just because I'm kind of a tech dork, was Diane von Furstenberg. I mean, she's been around for a long time. No big surprises in terms of fashion, but in terms of fashion technology, Diane von Furstenberg really hit a home run. Have you guys heard about the Google Glasses Project? Well, if you haven't, there's a really awesome walkthrough, you know, Google, Google Glasses, and they're these really awesome glasses you can put on your face. They cost about $1,500 if you want to, you know, chuck that down. But um, these glasses are amazing. They put all the Google products or a lot of great Google products into glasses that you're wearing on your face and kind of bring augmented reality to life. So um, all of the models that were walking during the runway show were wearing the glasses. Diane von Furstenberg came out at the end of the show wearing the glasses. And over the, the last week as they've been preparing for her show, everybody in her camp has been wearing the glasses, taking pictures, taking video with the glasses on, which gives you that real firsthand perspective um, from behind, you know, behind the scenes, backstage and all that. And they'll be releasing a video in uh, or on Google Plus in Diane von Furstenberg's circle. So make sure you follow her of uh, you know the whole experience with Google Glasses on behind the scenes. So it's really cool. I can't, I mean, I wish I could grab a pair of those glasses. If anybody wants to get me a pair, that'd be awesome. But um, anyways, check out some of the fashion shows today. Carolina Herrera already went by, so did Carlos Mille. Um, Rem Acra already went on, but you've got DK and Y later on today and a lot of other great shows. You can check those out on YouTube from their live stream. And make sure, if you haven't seen it yet, Trendwire has an incredible How to Follow Fashion Week online article. And um, I hope you guys are catching that to see all the different you know, resources that are out there to follow Fashion Week until this Thursday. So it's still going on, still going strong. Ends on Thursday the 13th. Follow us at Just Now Trending on Twitter. And also check out trendwire.com slash fashion. This is Cougar, and we'll catch you tomorrow.